270 Alberta. But those rents, folks, those are like 10 year old rental rates for Vermillion, man. You should be able to increase those rents up to about $1,000 a unit, right? This thing should be bringing in about $2,000 a month, right? The location. Uh, of this property that's really what's attracting the tenant right these are vermilion right you don't see a lot of duplex units in vermilion vermilion's a badass area man you're a hop skip and a jump away from cedar point uh port clinton marblehead kelly's island put in bay like dude this is where you want to be that's why you're able to get so much rent right uh and it's just going to be this area that draws it welcome to the investment property sales show folks thing is selling at or above list we are going to provide you guys with complete transparency and education we take you to the video tour won't wise to you giving it to you straight i got a big time money maker for you guys man let's check this one out 270 alberta vermilion ohio right coming to you at 139.9 and this property is all about the meat folks the meat that is on the bone this is like a big sizzling chunk of meat man this is you'd be like a viking eating this son bitch man it's priced at 139.9 okay and it's bringing in 1416 in rent all right 720 and 696 okay but those rents folks those are like 10 year old rental rates for vermilion man you should be able to increase those rents up to about one thousand dollars a unit right this thing should be bringing in about two thousand dollars a month right overall northeast ohio has seen a ton a ton of increase in rental pricing uh since this these tenants were placed in there, right? These are like long-term legacy tenants, right? I think uh, one of them been in there at least 10 years. Now, here's the thing, though, about getting those rents all the way up. If you look at the footage, you'll see that it looks like this unit hasn't been updated in years and years and years and years, right? So what I like to do in situations like this, guys, is I like to raise the rents slowly, okay? So like you got somebody paying six ninety six, you got somebody paying seven twenty. I wouldn't immediately be like, hey guys, thirty day notice, your month to month, boom, it's a thousand dollars or get the hell out, right? I don't like to do that. Now and it's not like a uh, like a bleeding heart thing or anything like that. It just doesn't make sense. Uh, from a financial perspective from the landlord, right? If you do that, guys, what probably is going to happen is at least one of those tenants is going to be like, well, screw you, dude. That's a huge rental increase. I can't afford that. Like for the one tenant, that's $304 a month. That's a massive increase. And what that's going to do is create an artificial turnover. And guys, you don't want to do an artificial turnover, right? Look how dated that unit is. You don't want to go through the process of renovating that unit if you don't have to, right? You're looking at like probably ten, fifteen thousand dollars to get that thing upgraded uh, to attract the tenant here in 2023, right? Now, the cool thing is the location uh, of this property, that's really what's attracting the tenant, right? These are Vermilion, right? You don't see a lot of duplex units in Vermilion. Vermilion's a badass area, man. You're right there by the islands, right? So you could even potentially uh, do something on this where you go long-term tenancy or you do some short-term like Airbnb, VRBO type stuff because you're right up there, man. You're a hop, skip, and a jump away from Cedar Point, uh, Port Clinton, Marblehead, Kelly's Island, put in bay Like, dude, this is where you want to be. That's why you're able to get so much rent, right? Uh, and it's just going to be this area that draws it. But even though the area is going to draw it, folks, you still got to obviously renovate the unit to attract brand new tenants. And you got to bring it up to 2023 20, standards and looks, right? Which is going to be expensive. So that's why I like to slowly increase their rents, right? Instead of going up like 300 bucks, why don't you do... A hundred dollar increase, a hundred dollar increase, and a hundred dollar increase. That way, over the course of a three year period, you're much more likely to have the very same tenant in the property paying you the thousand dollars a month, but you didn't have to come out of pocket like 10, 15 grand to renovate that unit, right? You got proven tenants in here that do pay rent, but they're not paying enough, in my opinion, right? That's why there's so much meat on the bone, right? I mean, technically, you could buy it and keep the rents where they're at, and you, you know, you'll chug along with a small amount of cash flow, right? But the real value here 
uh, is the amount of rents, uh, the amount of increase that you're able to do with these current rents, right? And if you do it slowly, you do it like that, in my opinion, you'll be able to get to your destination while spending the least amount of money, thus creating the highest return on your investment, right? Anyway, you slice it though. It's a solid deal. And if you guys want to buy it, all you got to do is shoot my team an email, send it to sales at holdenwise.com. If you want to pay cash, great. Send us your proof of funds and the amount you want to offer. If you want to finance it, great. Send us the pre approval from your lender and the amount you want to offer. And if you need a lender, you're like, yo, I would love to finance that thing, but I don't have a lender. James, can you help me out? You're darn right we can help you out. Just send us an email. We'll get you our list of lenders, lenders who write loans to investors just like you, located in all 50 states. Now, guys, my foreign nationals out there, I got you guys covered too. We do have lenders that will issue loans to foreign nationals. Now, they're not going to be as good as the loans that American citizens are able to get, right? They don't get the 25% down 30-year loans, right? But we do have lenders that will have an appetite for foreign national stuff. So my folks out there in Canada, the UK, Singapore, wherever y'all coming from, we got you covered too. Send everything to my team, sales at holdenwise.com. Let's go. Two seven zero Alberta sure. sales, whatever basement. Don't die. Oh, perfect. Yep, all right. There's stuff here. Thanks a lot, gimbal. Basement on fleek. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to Holton Wise TV for more financial information, education, and entertainment.